sir. What's going on everyone? Graveyard Grog here. It has been a while since I had actually done a video and an unboxing video at that. Um, been kind of busy lately. Got back into my home brewing. And I kind of, you know, haven't done the wine in a while. So, been looking around for some systems and I came across what I had to get it. So, um, can't, I ordered it about two weeks ago and it just came in. And uh, we are about to unbox it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So it is the Clawhammer 240-volt, uh, 20-gallon brew system. And I've been brewing on the Grainfather for a number of years now. I felt it's time for an upgrade. Definitely an upgrade. Time to move on. from. That. I mean, I'll still use it, but not nearly as much as I will this one. There's, you can do so much more with this. Bigger grain bills than when you're limited to, you know, how much you can use. But it, I mean, this one you can go, you can brew uh, 10 gallon batches and have like really high grain bills. So it came in. So let's do the unboxing, shall we? Let's do it. All right. For the unboxing. heavy box okay. all right sorry about that I forgot to have myself up in the little corner here so now we begin the unboxing. I just opened it. Haven't taken anything out yet. So let's see what we have. Uh, this looks to be eh, one of two hop spiders. Yep. All right. Go one at a time here. Oh, let me get this back in. Oh man, it's like Christmas. This is the heating element. Woo! Uh, just a fair warning about this. If you go to a proctologist and you see this, run. That's a heating element. That's sweet. That's... And this is my, uh, oh shit, you're kidding. My, uh, the 240 volt, uh, 20 gallon system. This is kind of busted up, but as long as the item itself isn't broken, that's the uh, 20 plate chiller right there. Water out, water in. Ward out, ward in. Ho water hoses get hooked up here, and your lines get hooked up there, and oh shit, here comes the cat. Oh shit. She has to inspect it. Is it all to your specifications? So, uh, yeah. <laughs> we pause this moment. <laughs> that had enough? Two hours later. Okay. 
Come on. Off. <laughs> so yeah, that's the uh, plate chiller boxes severely busted, but the plate chiller looks to be intact. Alright. This okay, this is what uh, gets plugged to the heating element that goes into the power supply. So right there. Here's the bag with all the doodads, whatnots, and hula bobbles. Now, this is my Christmas, but it's like Christmas for her. Come on. You do you come on. <laughs> Here. Okay, look. Go get it. Go get it. Anyway, got uh, plumbing tape, and we got, wow, everything's all individually bagged. Nice. So we got all the little faucets and who's and what's is, is and we got the, the little guys that uh, put the basket onto the, uh, the kettle. Got the little, uh, oh, that's a temperature probe. More of these little odds and ends. Very cool. This is everything. Everything is here. You got to put it together yourself. That's okay. I have no problems with that. I'm not going to go through each individual item in the bag here. So, that's that. This must be the pump. I'm guessing this is the pump. So I'm going to hold on that for now. Because I see some other stuff here. Uh, okay, that's the filter that goes in the bottom of the kettle. Very cool. Awesome, awesome. And this is the, uh, this is for the heating element. This is what I plug into. Yeah. So this and this and this all go together. Uh, I'm not going to put it together right now. Later on I will though. Okay. We got yeah. Okay, so let's do the hop spiders. Hop spiders next. Where's my? There it is. I think it's cool that you get two hop spiders, but truthfully, I don't know why you get two hop spiders. I don't see the difference. Just put everything into one. But two, better than none. Yep, damn. Love it. That's that's nice. I I like I love the quality of it. Sweet. So I got two of these. That's one of them. And then here's the other one. second hop spider eh, second one right here very cool all right now for the pump this is right doesn't matter which side but I'll go in from you know what let's have to go from this side Yeah, 
right. This here is the pump. Oh, it's heavy duty. Wow. That's got some weight to it. That plugs right into the main circuit box, which is what I'm going to be opening up next. Because now I won't be able to shut this all the way. Will I? Hell no. Maybe now? Maybe now? Now? Yeah, kind of. Whatever, that doesn't matter. And we got here the actual power supply. It's a lot of writing. Hey, you, read this. Warning stuffs that they have. This is definitely the control unit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, my God. And this don't, doesn't take just a regular plug. This takes a friggin' dryer sheet plug. <laughs> My goodness, you get out of that. Go, 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 shoot, 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 shoot. Wow. This can be wall mounted, which is good. Wall mount is good. Because. Because it's definitely getting mounted on the damn wall. Awesome. Okay. Power supply. Spiders. Anyways, I'm just telling me to just keep this in here. We got two more items. Three. I forgot. We got the lid. Start filling my hair. Anyway, well, I'll tell you what the brew cue wasn't joking. He said it's like a friggin' shield, and he was right. Kind of reminds me of the shield from uh, Clash of the Titans. To the reflection. Wah, wah, wah. Come over here, blah blah. <laughs> so that's the shield slash lid. It's... All right, and then, oh, four things. I'm sorry, the lid. We got the tubing. They say cut one, you get, uh, what was it, uh, 13 feet. So you cut a six footer, a, a four footer, and the rest is a three footer. Um, but I might be cutting differently only because I have a different kind of setup in my other room. Now we have two more items. We got the grain basket and then the kettle itself. Oh. That's a big one. That's big. Holy fuck. That's a lot. Put a lot of a lot of grains here. Well, you can do uh, 10 gallon batches on this. And then last but not least, these are resistance. Ah, the kettle. You get out of there. Got the claw hammer logo on it and everything. That's nice. And she is playing brave. 
you dare. She's going to. <laughs> you get a free kitty, too. <laughs> well, when she figures out how to get out of that, that was uh, my unboxing for the claw hammer 240 volt 20 gallon system I will set it up and then we'll end it with some pictures so until then cheers fears and beers they're coming to get you Barbara <laughs>